Hello everybody. Uh, today's video is a project that I've been wanting to do for quite a while and that is the two bicycle wheel duct tape wind turbine. Well this is actually a windmill right now because I don't have the motor hooked up yet but I do have at least four options on how to uh, hook up that motor. But anyway let me talk about this briefly and uh, we'll go okay, ahead so and test it. So the first thing I want to talk about is the two bicycle wheels that we have here and this came off a bike. Here's a picture of the bike. Okay, so the bike, I got at Goodwill. It was pink and purple, had two flat tires, but it was $10, and it had two good wheels on it, a good chain, um, a couple other good things that I, uh, I needed for other projects, so it was, a, it was a good deal for $10, Goodwill, good place to go for cheap bikes. So, on this uh, windmill right now, we're going to be turbine, I have a few options, and my first option would, would take a belt, go all the way around, and put my motor right here, or my generator right there. And that way, uh, as they both spin, it'll have more torque because these are smaller wheels. And that's why I also put the blades in the same direction. But I didn't have to with these bicycle wheels. You can turn it the other way so I could have them you know, opposing each other. No big deal on that one. Uh, but that would be good for if I wanted to put a, a generator there and there and just do individual belts. Uh, for each one. And a third option I could do, and I can't use this one because this is more of a brake, but I can attach some gears on the back here, which I, I do have a, a stockpile of. Attach one there, one there, and do an individual uh, chain drive for each one if these are, have enough torque in them to move that. Or another option would be to I do a, a rotor and a stator, do a three-phase uh, a three-phase generator AC, and just go ahead and I uh, convert that to DC for my uh, regulator at the end. So I have a, a few options on that, and let me just go ahead and show you the frame. This is just one two by four. Okay, there's that. Okay, here's the side view. And I am wondering, I think I may have the tail a little too small, but when I go to test it, if it's just spinning around in the back of the truck, well, obviously the tail's too small. I need to uh, do something a little bigger. But uh, I'm going to try that one first and see how it goes. All right, give you one more shot, and then we'll get to testing. So there's the back view of what it looks like. All right, let's get testing this guy. Okay, so the first test went actually really well. Um, I see the tail is about the right size. The blades, the duct tape blades, seem to uh, uh, hang in there. And the bicycle wheels seem to be uh, pretty stable on there. And more importantly, my new camera stand uh, held together. That's great. And uh, so pretty much in future videos, I will be attaching either a generator or generators um, either belt drive or chain drive or even three phase uh, AC. So we will uh, just have to go and see what works and what doesn't work on this. So, all right, thank you for watching this video as always. Take care and God bless.